going on, Swapito Squad? And today we were going to be opening up the Build and Battle uh, boxes. I got four of them here. I ordered six, but I'm going to save two for another video f for later on in the in the year, kind of near the end. I have a, an idea of what, what we are going to do. So, for the Fusion Strikes, as you can see here, um, not really. I don't really remember what the... the uh, I, I guess it's like the pre-release cards are I I know of two of them I'm pretty sure they're Latius and Latios I uh, just cut them all open so it's easier for me to uh, crack open so I'm pretty sure those are two of them I don't know what the other one is just gonna move those back here I don't know what the other one is so or the other two are I should say so crack this one open and I know you get Slow little, little booklet thing. Um, not really gonna read that, just gonna go right into it. And the first one is a Deoxys. I didn't know Deoxys was one of them, but I should have I should have figured that that's what it was one of them. And then there's the new code cards. So I'm not gonna open these up, I'm just gonna leave them how, how they are. Um, I'm sure people have seen them being opened up. Um, and then you get four four packs. So let's close. Let's go ahead and close this up. Put this back. I wasn't curious. Like, do people actually use the old build and battle deck boxes for anything? Like, do you actually use? Do you actually use them, or do you just toss them? So I know there is deck boxes that you can buy, like different ones, custom ones. Um, but I've always been curious. If people actually use those instead of like buying some if you guys play the games like the tcgs with actual people mantine quick ball and a ladius actually i think we need that ladius so that's a good card so i'm just gonna put these off to the side and i started making the fusion strike binder for the most part we have pretty much every uh, common and uncommon so now we're looking for obviously ultra rares and regular rares for the most part I think I'm missing like four or five commons and uncommon smeargo carvana clam pearl and a butterfree as the rare so we got a rare so far Put this over here. Go on to the next pack. Hopefully you guys' pulls have been a little bit better than mine. My pulls for Fusion Strike have not been extremely well. Probably my worst pulls of my TCG early pack opening career. Meltan, Toxel, Staryu, Melwile, Makuna, Marpeko, and we got a Crabonable V. We're going to sleeve that up. I don't think we have this, so that is perfect for the binder. A little Crabonable V. Usually the V cards are around a dollar or two. I, I'm sure this one's only a dollar. So, good first, first hit. Set them up over there. Off to the side. We will keep going. Hopefully you guys will be seeing this on Saturday. If not, I will be uploading this on the Sunday. Farewell Bell, Linion, Stanler, Makohita, Pampor, Smoodle, Skarmory, Jinx, Glary Meowth, and Electros Rare. So that was the first box. We got an ultra rare hit out of the first box. So that's not too shabby. Let's go into the next box here. Fucking pull off this wrapping. And, ooh, a Pokemon that I feel like everybody has a really hard time saying its name. But I've, I believe it's Pika, no, Pika Miku, Pika, 
Oh, I just screwed this up. I just watched a video of somebody talking about this card. Uh, Pikamiku? Pikamiku? I know I'm butchering this, but uh, we'll uh, we'll keep it going. So we got two out of the four, if I'm not mistaken. I believe it's four pre-releases. So if we can continue, and I believe the last two are Latius and Latios, if I'm not mistaken. Co card. So we can get those those two. That would be perfect. Darkness, Cook, Marcargo, Bug, Minion, Bell Toy, Corsola, Quailfish, Vulpix, Reverse Belby, and a Meltiota. Non hollow. Go into the next pack here. As my cards are going everywhere for some reason. Oh, it's this Mew. Mew packs. So, I'm not sure if you'll be seeing this before the next one that I do. I'm pretty sure I'm going to upload this one first. Uh, I have another video coming out where I open up all the Shining Fates tins. Just got all of them. All of the men. There we go. Basculin, Grubbin, Mankey, Grook, Pinsir, Reverse Rare, Meliota, and a Starmie. Don't think we have that one, so that is a. Why is this out of focus? Great pull for us for the binder. There we go. Whoa. Into third pack of this box. Co card. Lightning. Chill. Zorak. Eevee. Shinx. Shell me. Shell Meat, Drillber, Bellby, Gumi, oh we got something, and a Chandelier V, alternate art I believe, or full art. That's a pretty sweet pull. I actually really like this card. It reminds me of Beauty and the Beast, actually. <laughs> it's kind of weird, but everybody's got their... Their quirks 247 out of 264. So that is the Chandelier full art. It's a $5 card. Not too shabby. We are going to sleeve this up and put this in the binder later on. There we go. Again. Like that. It's really funny. <clears throat> We've gotten two ultra rare hits in two boxes. Build build a battle boxes. We've opened four five, four elite trainer boxes. Sixteen single slate sleeve blisters. <clears throat> and we've also opened up, I think, five three pack blisters, and then two of the single pack promo blisters and we got what four v cards out of a whole thing and out of two boxes here we've gotten uh, all two ultra rare hits one full art crazy pull rates on this quailfish and a coister all right let's go into the next one as i I should really have a bin for these cards. <laughs> Just toss them in the bin. Just keep the rares up top. Let's go into this one. So we are two for two on ultra rare pulls per box. We're also two for two here. If I can pull this off. I don't know why I opened it like that. Two for two on different build a battle promos. And we got our first double 
the Pikamiyu, Pikamiyu card that literally no one can say. There we go. So I'm not going to open that up. That's off to the side. I'm going to toss that one down there. We got three left. So, third box is the one with the devil. I usually don't try to show the back just because it kind of gives it away. Fighting, Lapras, Schoolboy, the Bruzz, Split Speed, <clears throat> Stuffle, Saint Agast, we have a Plusle in there, Reverse Bug, and a Kangaskhan Non Hollow. Let's go into the next one, the Genesect. The break, the breakdancing Genesect is a really nice card. Really nice alternate, alternate Zork, Metapod, Singapore, Toxel, Staru, Melwile, Makahuda, Pampor, Zora, Reverse, and a Deoxys Hollow hit. So you can grab this promo. And these are the two different Deoxes. Personally, I think I'm picking this one. I'm picking the one out of the building battle box for the art. Both both cool cards. Both cool cards though. Uh drop that off to the side. And go into this Gangar pack. I got the hot scene Snorlax. Always good seeing a fellow snore. Three. Simisage Dancer. Hucka. Snorlax. Snom. Drippy. We've gotten this guy so much. Rookie. Ooh, our first rare Melmetal. That's a cool card. And a. Oh, here we go. A, a Greedent Ultra Rare Hit V. They actually, not too long ago, for right right around the Halloween times, if anybody here plays Pokemon Unite, um, I actually really enjoy it. I play with one of my with one of my buddies. They added Greedent to, uh, to Pokemon Unite. Haven't used them yet, but uh, I have come up come across come across them. So that's cool. So each box so far has had an ultra rare hit or better. Um, I'm not saying go and grab the build and battle boxes, <laughs> but uh, if you're not buying booster boxes, this might be the way to go, honestly. Especially if you play, if you actually play TCG, like if you think about it, if you get this for market price, let's just say market price, um, you get all of them, you get all the cards, you know, you're like, all right, I'm going to start grading. So you start grading these cards, and sometimes if you get lucky and you get a 10, you can earn back your money on like, I don't know, three of them, EV and Electros. Like, especially like these, I think like... Like in the last, the last one, as we get into the last build a battle box here, the last uh, build a battle boxes with the evolutions on it, um, those in ten. If you get the Moltra, Zapdos, Articuno, all in tens, you'll and you buy a case, you'll you'll make your money back 100%. Um, so let's see. Ooh, I was wrong. Unless there's five promos. There is an Oricorio build and battle fusion strike on the right hand side here. It's really cool to see the differences because the fusion strikes on this on the right. Same with the Pikamayu. I'm literally never going to be able to say this name, guys. But when you look at the Deoxys, because there's so much on the right hand side with the fusion single rapid. They put it on the left hand side. That's pretty cool. So we got so far we got three out of the four. If you guys watched the uh, I 
tell if it was the chilling rain one or the the evolving or the evolving skies one uh, as i pull out the four packs here but we got the articuno like six times out of a possible i think it was like 10 i opened which was crazy i was just looking for the Maltras just to complete the collection but uh did not did not happen so hopefully the next build the battle box we open from evolving skies which there will be another one there will be another case well not a case sorry i should say i bought a bit a stadium so we get two two more chances pick in my youth i'm gonna keep that out and i will compare it to the other one for you guys uh voltorb pan sage kufant Flygar. we got something in this pack guys slugma we got a corviknight reverse rare and a Cernia V ultra rare hit. We did, this was one of the uh, cards that we did get in the, um, the, the comparison for the elite trainer boxes. So that's the one card, but so far, uh, if you compare anything, these are the best. These are the best to buy just out of the pack rates or pack pull, pull rates so far out of these. So here's the comparison out of the two. So here's the one in the set to the right. Here's the uh, Fusion Strike build a bottle uh, promo, obviously. With the logo on the bottom right. So we got three more packs to be opened here. Oh my god. Can we pull another ultra rare hit? Drugna, Sligu, Shana, Buneary, Busklin, Grubbin, Mankey, Gunk, Fluxerio, and a Huntail non hollow. Rare. Two more packs out of this build a battle selection we got going on here. Code. Hope you guys are grabbing the codes. Two, three, four. Lightning. I thought that was the rare for some reason. Breloom. Switch. Mudkip. Caterpie. Morpeko. Eevee. Shelter. Schoolgirl Reverse. And a Landrius Holographic Hit. Not too bad, not too bad. Last pack, this is usually where I ask you guys to hit that like button. If you enjoyed, if you got any of the codes, please hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button, we're on our way to 100 subs. Right now, as I'm recording this, we've got 62 subs. And if you have made it this far, I will give you a sneak peek of what I ordered. Wave two of the Pokey Rev packs have been ordered. They are shipped and they are on their way. So I am hoping that they get here next week and I will record them next Saturday. That is the, the goal, that's the hope. Um, I know with the holidays coming around, it, some of the uh, shipping companies are a little delayed on a few days, usually. So my hope is that it will get here Thursday, Friday, and we will open it on the Saturday and I will upload it on the Saturday or the Sunday. Um, so if you could leave a like, that'd be great. And the last pack magic is a Corviknight rare hit. All right, guys. So that is it for this video. These are the, the four pulls, four boxes. We got four boxes, four ultra rare pulls, and we got three out of the total four build a battle box promos from this. I think this is a huge W considering what we've opened before. If you think, uh, if you liked everything, uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Swaffed us out. Have a good one.